Hi, it's Nancy, your Over 40 Princess, and we have a lot to get to. I made one before and I went over, so let me try again. A little less this time. This is my Friday fashion. Day late because of the contest. And I want to talk about scarves real quick. Um, scarves are really super in, but unless they're for warmth, I wouldn't invest a ton of money in them. Unless like this one, which I got to pay less, by the way, in my favorite colors. I am shocked by the amount of purple I own. I mean, really shocked and horrified beyond belief. You can use this as a wrap when you're going out. The threads catch very easily, so you have to take really good care of it. But it is got a nice fringe on it. I wouldn't do anything but hand wash this. If you get something on this, I would hand wash it. Anything from Target or Payless or anywhere else. Of course, there's a purple one too, which we won't discuss. Because we all know that I have an addiction. I've never heard of a anti-purple society, so I think I'm stuck. Skinny belts are really, 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 really in, which is great. If you are this big around the waist, skinny, 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 skinny belts have a tendency to make everything around them look bigger than it is. I mean, I have a 23-inch waist, and I will not wear a skinny belt around it. It just doesn't look good. It's got to be at least this thick. Okay. Um, I really like wide, wide belts. They really highlight a small waist. Um, so that's one particular trend that I am not going to jump on the bag and my bandwagon with. This is about as skinny as I go. This is for jeans, and it's red croc and it's payless. And of course, it's not real croc, but it looks crocky alligatory. And it's um, it's nice because it's got a weighty buckle without being ginormous booth on bones buckle which I love but not on me and it's got a good sheen to it and, and it's fairly sturdy it's 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 gonna last a long time and you know what this is never gonna go out of style you'll be able to wear this in 10 years on your jeans so with your jeans and a little cute white top with a little cute jacket you're not gonna look like an American flag just wear a you know a wash in your jeans that isn't super it's just super dark not like American flag color okay. um, I like chunky jewelry and I want to show you this this came from Orchid Lane in Ann Arbor and they have a website which of course I'll post on my blog I post and the link to my blog is right there Orchid Lane is fair trade I got my shirt at Orchid Lane and yeah it's a t-shirt for summer but I don't like sleeves which is a shame because my arms really need sleeves. <laughs> but um, it came from Orchid Lane, and it's not the only thing I have from Orchid Lane. But everything is reasonably priced, even they're really beautiful things. And they reclaim sari fabric for skirts, and they're just really a great company. And um, fair trade and excellent shipping for those who, who purchase out of Ann Arbor. Michigan, and if you're in Ann Arbor, you've they've got a fifteen dollars store where everything is fifteen dollars or less. Next door to their regular store, where everything is, you can run up to like a hundred, but for the most part, they have a lot of great sales. And if you hit them during a sidewalk sale, which goes on around the time of the Ann Arbor Art Fair, um, you can really score gorgeous stuff for fantastic prices. <laughs> Lots of beautiful, beautiful silk. As we've discussed, I made these. Memory wire. Needle nose or round nose pliers. And beads you can pick up anywhere. Fire Mountain Gems is the cheapest. Joann's has got them. You know. And you can layer them up. I love chunky jewelry. I love good, good weight heft I wish the colors came through better on this monitor um, they don't 
I also took peridot and silver and made one. So real silver beads and peridot. Um, and then you know about my cool little satiny looking bead one. I got this at Payless for four dollars. Was originally eight. It's nice because it's timeless. I mean, tortoise shell looks. Real tortoise shell is illegal to own in this country. Not to own, but to bring into this country. If it's if you're having an antique or something, you can have that. Um, just like an old ivory keyboard. Um, but plastic looks really, really close, and this this is very close. And this is going to look good in ten years because it just keeps going in and out, 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 in and out. This year happens to be a big year. I got these at the icing for Indian looking jewelry, and you know, really, it's been a trend that hasn't gone away. And I love the look of this kind of stuff. Just be careful if you're a small person like I am that you're not covered in heavy, chunky, 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 chunky jewelry. Um, I saw the wrist ring online and I mentioned that I wanted it. And if I can find it in the pile, it's here somewhere. And no, it's not. <gasps> oh well. On um, the flower ring. That's the gemstone. Mm, it's too big for my hand, too heavy for my hand, and I couldn't try it on in the store. And um, I'm not sorry, sorry that I bought it, but I'm not overly excited about it either. So, um, again, peacock colors, very in this year, very in. Oh, here it is. It's size 6. It should fit this finger. It doesn't. So I don't know what's going on. It's too big for this finger, and it just completely overpowers my hand. You know, I mean, I can wear it a little bit, but not much. And they were out of the beautiful purple one. But I need more purple like I need a hole drilled in my skull. This kind of tight are very in. Beautiful, gorgeous. As long as your calves are not really big. And you can be super skinny and have huge calves. Okay? I'm not picking on anybody. This does not look good when everything on it is straight up and down and then to get around your calf it has to do this. Be aware of that. Stick legs. It's unfortunate but true. Besides, they're not very warm. Alright, purses. I got these at Payless. And, of course, I got the big bag in purple. This is on my list. I'm going to get one in red, too. And then I got the big bag in giraffe, which is my favorite pattern, and it makes me happy. You probably couldn't guess that, huh? Okay. And so, oh, almost it. The last thing I want to show you is this. I have a friend who makes these, and before I put the link up, ha ha ha, the link on my blog, I'm going to ask her if she's got the time to make them, and they're very reasonably priced, to make them for people who contact her on the internet. My dog wants out of the room. I've got the door closed because of the kids. Um, really, really, really beautiful. Does fabulous finish work on her jewelry. Just can't say anything bad about it. It's just sturdy and gorgeous and I hardly ever wear it because I'm afraid something's going to happen to it and then I would be heartbroken because she gave this to me and it was just one of those beautiful presents I've ever received. Well thought out, very Nancy. It's got that chunk feel to it. So, I love chunky, chunky, big, big, big. But because I love chunky, chunky, big, 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 and I'm a small person, I don't cover myself with earrings, necklace, bracelet, and rings. It's like two things. Earrings and a bracelet. Small earrings and a necklace. Now remember that. If you're larger, you can get away with bigger. 
that's one good thing when I was really heavy. I mean, I had major, massive, huge jewelry. It was awesome. All right. That's all for the Fashion Friday. Have fun. Play with your makeup.